Hey guys, it is 6.30 on July 16th. It's Friday. I got home from work about an hour ago. I drank my pre-workout already. I'm about to go work out, but I just wanted to start the vlog for the weekend today because I always start on Saturday morning. I want to do some self-care today, um, work out, wash my hair, get all nice and settled for the weekend, and then I also want to do some editing for tonight. But for now, I'm going to head downstairs and I'm gonna work out. Today was a much better day at work. Well, it was it was still chaos, but it was a much better Friday than last week was. Um, I have a couple things to show you guys um, that I got from Amazon, also from Shein. So I will see you guys in a bit. So I just got done with my workout. It was a light, lighter one. Usually on Fridays, I have recently anyway, been trying to take it a little bit more easy with my workouts just to kind of give myself a break. I use it on Friday as more of a more of a mental thing than anything else, like just to make sure that I de-stress kind of thing. So I did that, um, it was about 30, 40 minutes. And now I'm about to have something to eat because I'm starving. And if anybody knows, I am Trinidadian. I'm having roti and curry chicken. <laughs> I'm not having the whole thing because it's not the, the most healthiest meal to have. So I'm going to have half of a roti skin which is just kind of like the wrap and then a little bit of curry chicken. So I'm gonna have that and then shower wash my hair, and then get to work on editing. So it's now 8.49. Um, I've washed my hair, I just put some conditioner in it, um, combed it out and everything. Tomorrow, um, I'm gonna try to wake up early enough. Turn off the light. Um, actually, let's turn off this. I know my air conditioner is really loud. I think we've discussed why that is. So I came to a conclusion that I want to get into more. I want to go back to school, but for something completely different. Um, not necessarily education. I love teaching. I will always love teaching, but I think I've been teaching since I was 19 or 20, 19, 20. And I'm now 30, so it's about 10 years, about a decade of my life that I've been working with kids, and I love kids. It's such a joy to be able to work with children and just see them grow and develop and change over the course of the year and know that you are the you had a part of that. But it's hard. It's a, it's a hard field to be in. And I, I just I want to see what else is out there in terms of my skill set, in terms of what I can accomplish and what I can provide to the world. And obviously I will always be able to fall back on teaching because it's something that I feel is a part of me and that I love a lot, but I think I want to do something a little bit more creative. Probably doesn't make any sense right now, but I feel excited about where this mindset is going to take me. So um, I'm gonna get to editing. Where did I leave my water? I left my water in the kitchen. I will talk to you guys in a few. Good morning. It's now 10.23 on Saturday, July 17th. And I am just waking up. Oh, I'm not waking up. I'm just getting out of bed. But... I'm about to get my day started. So I ordered the other day, I ordered a pack of liquid IV because everyone's been talking about it and everyone's been using it and I wanted to see if it's worth it. I've been trying to do at least one pouch or one stick and I got the lemon lime flavor. I haven't noticed a big difference in like my hydration levels 
but it makes the water taste really good. Um, so I carry one usually to work, so why not? So, I actually bought some new sheets on Amazon, like Wednesday, maybe Wednesday or Thursday. My first time buying an all-white set. I'd washed them last night, so that's why they're here and they're not really folded up. But so this is the fitted sheet. And I have this came with the blanket. Then I have I think these are the two pillow shams, and then the flat sheet. These four came together, and then the comforter set came together. So it's two pieces, well, three pieces here. Hi. So this has like a striped kind of texture. I don't know if you can see it. Whereas the sheets, obviously, they don't. They're just kind of the thing. And then this is the blanket. <laughs> Hopefully, you know, we stay on top of like not eating in the bedroom because we're kind of guilty of that. Um, mostly like snacks, like late at night snacks and stuff like that. Um, the brand actually is um, Bedshore, I think. I can link them down below if anybody wants them. But it was a really decent price and I figured let me try to go on something a little bit cheaper for my first like all white set. But yeah, so these are going to go on my bed in a little bit and the sheets that I have on my bed now are going to go wash and be put away. But right now I'm going to finish, just tidy up a little bit and then probably get started on my workout. And here we have the blanket all set up. Ignore that over there. I'm cleaning that still, but I love it. I love it, I love it. Obviously the lighting in here isn't the greatest, so it doesn't look as pristine as it should, but I absolutely love it. Good morning guys, it is now, oh I thought I wasn't focusing, it's now Sunday, um, what day, the 18th I think? I think it's like about 10 or 11, it's 11. I woke up around 8.30 and I've been finishing editing my um, Cancun video which is going to go up like in an hour or two. So you guys will be seeing that today when I'm recording now. But yeah, it's Sunday. It's so far, it's a good morning. It's pretty chill. I feel productive already. I just, I woke up and I put on my, um, my workout tights. So once that finishes rendering and I do my thumbnail and description stuff, then uh, I will take my pre-workout and head out to work out. But yeah, hoping it's a pretty good day. Um, mental wise, mentally wise. Mentally, I hope I have a good day. <laughs> I'm about to take this pre-workout. Flowers even mad about it. Cause they can't blow like you don't. I don't see a way around it. Cause everything has led me straight to you. It's nothing new. Baby, I'm outside. Been thinking about you all night. Been thinking it ain't right if you and me. Only see us in our dreams, I'm outside Be thinking about you all night Be thinking it ain't right if you and me Only see us in our dreams, I'm outside Sunrise, no destination, no lie I've been so patient, like winter Waiting for June I'm done and waiting for you Waiting for you Baby, I'm outside Been thinking about you all night Been thinking it ain't right if you and me Only see us in our dreams I'm outside Thinking 
I don't even know what to say. I just finished my workout. It was awesome. Um, do you see? This is crazy. Such a good workout. Um, I did lift and burn number 16 by the workout. Such a good one. Such a good one. And then I did the cardio, my cardio before. <sighs> I'm gonna go take a shower and I don't know. I'm just, this, this, this workout put me in such a good mood. It's, it's such a good mood. Um, I feel great. <laughs> I don't keep looking at the thing because I can't believe how sweaty I am. But it feels so good. I feel so strong today. <sighs> this is a good one, guys. You should check out the workout. Hey guys, so um, it's now about 7.30 and um, I was gonna end the vlog here, but I just remembered that I have been saying recently um, that I'm gonna show off a couple of things that I got from Shein. And it's not a lot, but um, I don't know, I just wanted to share it. So the first thing I'm gonna start with is a couple swimsuits I got. This kind of tie-dye marble looking one. I wore this when we went to the Sinote Hubiku with the same kind of bottom. So this was also a 1X as well as this one. I didn't wear this one yet. Hopefully before the summer is over, I'll wear it maybe a beach day or something. It's just this striped rainbow. Really cute, really simple. It ties in the back and then here are the bottoms. Just the same pattern. Also 1X. I was not expecting to like them as much as I did, but I definitely want to order more swimwear from Shein. So let's hope my wallet is not too mad at me after that. But anyway, I also have another order on the way. Um, but we're not talking about that. I haven't worn any of these yet. So this is a dress. I kind of got this for work. So it's just a floral pattern, multicolor kind of dress. This is in a zero XL. I haven't tried it on yet, but I'm assuming this will fit. Um, yeah, I got this for work. It looked pretty modest and a decent length for me to wear when I'm with the kids. Obviously, I wear like shorts and stuff under it, but just in case I do feel like wearing a dress one day. So I got this bodysuit and this one was, this one was also a 1XL. And I feel like this might be a little too big for me, but I haven't tried it on with a bra yet. So I tried it on without a bra and it was a little big, but I have to try it on with one. Maybe it'll fill that out a little bit better, but it's just a simple white bodysuit. I don't wear a lot of white. So I want to start. <laughs> so I thought it was cute. It was simple. It has a little bow tie in the front. Obviously, I like to go for the frilly things. I also got this dress, which I tried on and it fit so nice. I am in love with it. I know this is kind of trendy right now. Um, I've been seeing it all over TikTok, dresses like this. So I really wanted to try one up myself to see if it looks good on me, not just all the other girls. And it did. It looked so pretty and I can't wait to wear it. It's just one of those lavender um, floral dresses and it has like the elastic at the top so you can wear it like on your shoulders or off your shoulders at the side and I'm really excited about it and I think it looked really cute and um, I would try it on for you guys but I want to wear it once in a video and show it off. So The next piece I have is another bodysuit and this one was also 1XL. It's just a normal gray, basic, nothing too crazy. I need more bodysuits, um, especially ones in neutral colors that I can wear under like sweaters and cardigans for the fall. So I'm already kind of thinking about my outfits for the fall because it's my favorite season. I also got this crop kind of peplum floral lace top. And it's a little big for me, honestly. Um, I also got this in a 1XL. And, like, it fit, but it was also kind of loose. So, like, it, it looked really cute. It looked really cute. And I tried it on with some jeans. And it, it was really nice. It's actually really cute. But it's just a little bit too big. I probably would still wear it. But I feel like I'd have to feel really a lot more secure. And, like, wear some kind of um, the fashion tape where you can stick it on so it doesn't fall off. <laughs> but it's really cute. I could probably get away with getting this in a 0XL, just an extra large. We'll, we'll figure out how to work it. The last thing that I got, <laughs> so I have yet to um, order pants from Shein. And um, I was talking to my friend one day and she said that she ordered some jeans and she ordered some palazzo pants and she was like, yeah, I'm really excited for them. And I was like, I haven't ordered anything from any pants from Shein bottom wise because 
I'm nervous about the fit because I can tell when something fits me on top, but my hips and my legs, um, like my thighs, <laughs> I, the measurements are always weird. And sometimes some, like, you, like I'm sure you understand if you have a, a higher hip ratio to like waist and upper body, um, it's difficult. So the, the dimensions or the, the measurements of my hips and my, um, my thighs, it really changes how outfits fit me, obviously. So I was a little nervous, but I tried it anyway because it was on sale and it was really cheap and I figured why not. And I just ordered these khaki um, jogger looking pants and they're really, really, really light, like, like thin, I should say. So the quality isn't too great and I feel like if I bend over or move in a certain way it might like just rip um so i tried them on and they fit they fit really nicely um they're a little bit tight but that's okay but they're actually pretty cute but yeah that's about everything that i got from shein so far i do have one more order coming in which you guys will probably end up seeing in another vlog um and i think i honestly might end the vlog here i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching um i have a lot more things planned and um, I'm really excited for the rest of my summer. Um, but yeah, so I will see you guys next time. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe and thank you for watching. Bye!